Every miracle that Jesus performs has a purpose. Yes, that purpose is to heal and to save, but it's also to teach us something about him. His miracles drive us to realize exactly who he is and what he came to do. The miracle that I'm about to read teaches us just that. It's a time again where he heals someone. But he was teaching the Pharisees through this miracle exactly why he came and that he had power to forgive sin because he's God. Same thing when we read Jesus' miracles in his word, they teach us about him, that he's God and he came to save us. They teach us to listen to his word and that we can trust his word to be true because look it, he performed these amazing miracles. So listen to this miracle from Matthew chapter 9 and know that Jesus is teaching you through it. So he, Jesus, got into a boat, crossed over, and came to his own town. Just then, some men brought to him a paralytic lying on a stretcher. Seeing their faith, Jesus told the paralytic, Have courage, son, your sins are forgiven. At this, some of the scribes said to themselves, He's blaspheming. Perceiving their thoughts, Jesus said, Why are you thinking evil things in your hearts? For which is easier to say, Your sins are forgiven, or to say, Get up and walk. But, so that you may know that the Son of Man has authority on earth to forgive sins. Then he told the paralytic, Get up, take your stretcher, and go home. So he, the paralytic, got up and went home. When the crowd saw this, they were awestruck and gave glory to God who have given such authority to men. This is the word of our Lord. What is Jesus wanting you to know about him as you read his word? That's what he's asking you here. And in this section, he tells us very clearly, he has the authority to forgive sin, and he proved it by healing that man. Sometimes we can doubt that we are really forgiven. Sometimes we can wonder, has God forgiven me, or is he still holding on to this one sin that I just keep performing over and over again? Will he let that go? Listen to Jesus' words. He has the authority to forgive sin. He showed it in this this miracle, excuse me, and then he demonstrated it most clearly at the cross. He forgave all of your sins, rose from the dead so that you can be certain that every single one of them has been forgiven. Know this about your Savior and take heart this week. Amen.